Hello together! So today is unboxing time again and uh, I have something special for you. You might be wondering why this empty pet bottle is uh, here on my table and what the heck do these earrings have to do with that? I will show you how you can create filament out of pet bottles that you then can print on your FDM printer to create all kinds of stuff. I made earrings with these. These are ginkgo leaves. Maybe you have seen some other videos where I reviewed the filament that somebody sent me from America. I will put his link underneath the video. There is also a Facebook group and the thing is called PetBot. Let's take a look inside. Oh, where do I have a knife? You can buy it from the Precious Plastic website. They have a bazaar there. And uh, last few days I borrowed a machine because we had a, a schoolmaker fair and I showed the procedure there and the people were so interested. It's really cool. So, let's see what is inside. I will make a time lapse video of the assembly. Oh, lots of parts flying around there. I think the, yeah, you see they opened up the box, I guess, at the customs because they wanted to take a look inside. I hope nothing is missing, otherwise I will be very angry. They ripped up, open everything. Okay, let's get out the wooden parts first. See, this is what what it will look like on the top. Oops! Oh, that's the motor. <laughs> uh, oh, he even, even added a spool. Oh, that's just. Uh, I'm really angry about the customs. I can't believe that he sent it that way. I guess they ripped it open. Oh. I hope nothing got damaged in there. Oh, everything's already pre-wired in there. That is really, really cool. Okay, let's get this out of the way. Let's take a look. So, what do we have here? I guess these are some feet or something. I have a video. This is why I'm not going to do a live stream because I have to watch the video to see the how the assembly is done. And I will also show you the procedure how to prepare the bottles, but this is not going to happen today. So, in here we have... Yeah, I don't know what all this is. I will have to to ask. Okay. Uh, there's no electrical, no wire. Yeah, but I have I have some of those, so no problem. But they could have incorporated it, and I guess if I see this flying around here. Ah, this is for the for the hot end. I have to add myself. Okay, that's not no, no problem. Yeah, I hope that nothing got damaged uh, in there. And uh, yeah, okay, this is the heating cartridge. Yeah, everything is very straightforward. Okay, so that that's the let's start the time lapse, and then hope we get finished quickly.
So I hope you liked it. This is what I have printed with the strips that uh, I have produced with the machine. I combined different uh, strands of um, filament that I made with the machine. And I will show you not only how to cut it, because maybe you have recognized that I was using pre-cut strips. I don't have the, the possibility to prepare the bottles here at home. I have everything that I need at the makerspace. So last weekend I prepared the bottles there. And uh, so I made this little vase with it. You can only see that it was combined because the color is slightly different. Maybe you cannot see it here on, on, uh, on screen. But there's a slight uh, difference in color. Then I made this filament yesterday. It's from a local a uh, lemonade brand called Elmer Citro. It produced a really awesome looking filament, deep green. It prints really nicely. And I made these, yeah, everybody knows these already. These are the pet bot keychain holders. And um, yeah. So far, it has been a great experience. I gave the creator of the machine already some feedback what he could improve, uh, but nothing, nothing um, major, just small little things that you could maybe even 3D print by yourself. And it really works nicely. And I'm looking forward how this bottle cutter works. And I will create further videos. I will show you how I join the filament parts it really worked nicely on this one, so I had to practice a bit, but uh, in the meantime it works really nicely. So you can create um, maybe a full, even a full roll of uh, filament instead of only having small pieces. And um, yeah, I will show you the trick because <laughs> I have a special um, procedure how I blow up the bottles uh, to make them even because sometimes the bottles, you know, they, they have funny shapes and you want to have a, a straight wall uh, to get the maximum length out of the bottle. I will show you how that works. So stay tuned for the next video. See you in the next one. Bye bye.